this beautiful brown stash of a dog was found in August 2017 in Gloucestershire by two metal detecting enthusiasts. And that's definitely the find of a lifetime. It was found together with many other metal objects which look like they've been intentionally broken. This is not unusual. We will never know who buried the objects and why, but the most likely scenario is that it was a metal worker that managed to get hold of all these scraps of bronze who then intended to melt again to be reused. This is obviously the most remarkable part of the hoard. It represents a dog with the tongue sticking out. It is in almost perfect condition and it was found in an important part of Britain during the Roman period. We know that not too far away there was a temple which has been excavated at Lydney Park, also in Gloucestershire. This temple was dedicated to Nodens, which was a Celtic god. Nodens is associated with healing, medicine, with hunting and crucially with dogs. It was believed, in fact, that the, the dogs had healing powers and that just by uh, licking somebody's wound could help the recovery. It is quite remarkable the fact that the, also the tip of the tongue uh, is still intact and wasn't damaged when it was buried. The uh, dog is beautifully decorated on the shoulders. It's a geometric leaf pattern uh, on both sides. Another salient feature is these two little holes on the side of the dog. These are not casting mistakes uh, that deliberate. We can only speculate that they would have held some other object uh, attached to the dog. We know that in the hoard uh, there was another fragment of a human face that we have here, which was probably part of a larger figure, maybe attached to the dog, possibly representing the uh, god Nordens himself or one of the patients that came to be healed by the dogs. It's in perfect condition and it is a remarkable find for Britain in the Roman period. It's a unique object.